we have sent out seven notices cutting across uh, what we are trying to do to correct the city area. One, uh, three notices, four notices around the transport sector. We have, uh, have issued a notice that from Monday, we don't want town services to be around CBD. You will go back to the route. We have issued the notices, the notices in terms of routing. We are going to release them to circulate out. So town services, go back to where, we are, where you are. All those services you have been doing for the last two weeks as we pilot cannot work. Then Kamas stage has been disbanded. Trans County and the uh, Bongama line report to Kibutko at the bus stage. Get a space. The Matatus that have been operating uh, at Aero Mugwok go back to Kibutko for space allocation. The ones opposite Agakan called the Biafra. That's, there's, not, there's nothing like uh, Biafra stage. Go back to Kibutko for allocation. Tuk Tuk, the ones near Palmas, go back to Kibutko to allocate your space near the bus stage. Tuk Tuk, the ones near, opposite Agakan, near Dal Kotel area, go to Uru Business Market. Trucks that have been get, getting the bypass, especially the Shuakin trucks or heavy loaded trucks. Please, you are restricted to use Rabuor area to Kibos. Don't show up with your truck from Monday uh, near the bypass. You have caused a lot of more accidents in four series of accidents. You have killed small children there. You have killed people with tuk-tuk. You have killed mothers there. You have killed young people. So we are not going to allow trucks to follow that route again. Use, use the Rabuor. And you have excessively littered that street, that road. It is excessively smelling and stinking with sugarcane litters. So, Rabuor is your route. If you don't, if you show up with that truck at that area, we'll confess your truck and you'll pay 50,000 shillings as a fine. So, go back to Rabuor and use Rabuor Kibos Road. Now, border border, we have told you to stop Mulimani, stop parking around Mulimani. You need to do drop off. Not only Mulmani, within the estates. Park at the areas that you are designated to do. And we are restricting you to start registration. From 1st of July, we are going to restrict you. Either you charge fairly one passenger with a helmet and, uh, and, a and the jacket. But don't carry four more than three or four passengers in border border. We are going to restrict your movement. And within you, filter out the thugs that are within the border border that are causing uh, heinous problems in this city. Now, we have also restricted the musics. We are reiterating music, noises, new, more noise pollution in the estates, especially Milimani. If you know you are running a restaurant in Milimani, Milimani and you play music at night, you have seven days. I have written, I'm writing a letter on Monday to the liquor board to revoke your licenses. Your licenses will be revoked if you are making any noise in the estate be it Milimani or everywhere. So, do the restaurant, sell food and other things, but don't play any music in the estate. Those are the restrictions we are trying to implement on all those sectors. The final one, the traders in a pin district, Garissa Lodge and Nyamlori, start your mass exodus to Uru business market. Whether, whether you meander or you do what, you will leave. You must leave. You will go. So don't wait for me to come to, re to restore order there. The, re the repairing and upgrading of manholes and sewer lines and the drainage of block there should start by 15th July. I've given you up to 15th July. Live on your own. Go and occupy your stalls. We want to start reorganizing that CBD2 area, opening those drainage and opening those manholes. Please leave the place. There's no way you will not leave. You will leave and you must leave. Start leaving in the next two months and go. Thank you. So, so, so that's okay. Um, so, yeah. so, yeah. so, yeah. so, yeah.